um, I put the blue things on my dual disc now. Uh, you can see I put the red little triangles that tell you where the cards go on as well. Um, so pretty much this part of the dual disc is done. Um, but that was the easy part because this is relatively flat. Next, I have to do the arm piece. And the arm piece involves that circular part that I, I have to find a ribbon or something to tie it to my arm with. But I need piece, which I'm using plastic cap from Trader Joe's Hummus. Woo! So, um, I'm basically going to cut out another piece that the shiny gray picture that I used to make the metallic-y look on my tool disc and just cover the circular part of it with. And, um, there's a really awkward red-shaped piece on it, so sort of got the gist of the shape here. The idea is that I'm going to attach it here and then attach the dual disc something like that over the part that I didn't really bother to cut out. So, um, there's a few other little details I have to take care of. Like, I have to make a piece come off here for where the deck would be if I were carrying a deck there that I really need to worry about. And a little piece, silver piece to go over here that would keep the deck in place. So, um, other than the fine tuning and getting something to support this so that it doesn't flop midway through the day, um, that's next. Uh, in case you wanted to know what I did here, this is pretty much me just eyeballing the shape out of an extra piece of cardboard. So, yeah, there's not really much that I could, I mean, you could probably, like, look and make it really accurate. Again, I'm only needing it for six, not even, I'm needing, uh, I need it from, like, eight in the morning till about three o'clock in the afternoon. So, in terms of making it really, really nice looking, not my biggest concern. So, that's pretty much a shape. Um, if you wanted to go on something... Um, sort of looks like a pear, you know, just a pear. Mm, yeah. So, uh, yeah. Till next. <laughs> Hi. Okay, guys. So, um, here's my hummus cap that I said I was gonna use. Uh, as you can see, I covered it with the shiny paper, and um, this is actually stuck on. As you can see sort of underneath so that I just have the piece that sticks out there for the look. Um, getting the red piece on was hard. Um, to make it actually work, what I did was cord it for some pencil wear. Um, but taping it to this got a little tough. So there's tape underneath here that is securing it. There's also tape wrapped around from the cap underneath the lid to here, so that's helped keeping it in place. Um, try not to do anything permanent because I may have to disassemble this later, so again, like I said, I would need it for a day. Um, for the most part, it's sticking together pretty well. Um, my guess is that I am probably going to have to put something across here which would be fine, because I actually have to tape something over here anyway, so that'll cover it. Um, next part is probably going to be getting this, these pieces, on over here. And um, adding details. Um, so, next update, we should start putting it together two pieces. Hi! Okay, so, um, did the details first. So, um, this is the part that goes over. I can actually slide things in here, surprisingly. Um, if I would, you would probably fit, like, a quarter of the deck if I really wanted to, like, stick something in there, but it's not really supported that well. So, it would probably fall out. Um, 
pretty much detail here, detail here. Um, I'm going to attach uh, the dual disc over here so you don't see this edge. That's why I'm not worried that it doesn't reach all the way to the end. Um, basically, I did end up taping across here. Um, you can kind of tell by the light that um, I actually taped across here too so that this would go over here. Um, just thought I'd show you guys this before I put the final pieces on here. Cool. Okay, so I'm going to quickly show you what I did to put this together. Um, that's masking tape. Looks kind of gross from the bottom, but someone has to see the bottom, so it's okay. Um, to keep this from flopping sideways, I tape an extra piece of cardboard here, so it'll keep it open. Um, and now I'm just going to tape it to this piece. So, Alright, so, here's my tool disc. Uh, for the most part, I think it looks pretty good. Uh, there's your bottom, masking tape. Uh, there's actually right here a piece of clear packing tape to make sure it doesn't fold over. Uh, not the prettiest thing in the world, but for a homemade dual disc, I think it looks okay. Uh, I'm just going to get a ribbon, and I'm going to attach it here. So the last thing you'll see is Okay, so, attached to my arm, my dual disc.